So in the field here, you can tell already by looking at all of this brown stuff, that was um, big green weeds that was in here. If we do this a couple different times on this pasture, he's going to have a lot better pasture ground acres. This right here, and when I point it up, that all that brown stuff there, that's dead weeds. Really, really impressed. Hey, how's it going folks? I'm Mike with New Way Ag. You guys asked on this video here of spraying that pasture ground if I can do a follow-up video. So that's what I'm doing. I just pulled up here and I'm telling you, without even going into the field already, I know that this application absolutely worked great. For the ones that didn't watch the video, it went something like this where we came out, we did the boundary, we put in 10 gallons an acre, we sprayed this, we had some obstacles that we had to go around, but I'm going to walk into this field and show you guys what we were spraying. We were spraying for noxious weeds, woody vegetation, to keep that stuff down so more grass will grow. A healthier grass pasture is going to be better for your horses and cattle than you know having woody vegetation. But I'm gonna walk out there and show you guys. Just like a quick look, I can tell already all this brown stuff is noxious weeds that got knocked down. So in the field here, you can tell already by looking at all of this brown stuff, that was um, big green weeds that was in here. We'll try to do a comparison of what this stuff looked like. That's on its way out. If we do this a couple different times on this pasture, he's going to have a lot better pasture ground acres. Right down here in this patch, this is where I, uh, I showed you guys this stuff before and then I point it up like that like that that is this right here and when I point it up that all that brown stuff there that's dead weeds really really impressed the biggest thing about these drones is knowing how to set the parameters and knowing what your swath width is and what your route spacing should be and how high above the crop this field here we did 10 gallons an acre so it really does work let's take this drone off and see what it looks like Look at that, it absolutely worked. Okay, after flying the drone, I'm telling you guys, these drones absolutely work for doing applications. So if you're looking to get a drone, get a hold of us, newwayag.com. We manufacture trailers, we sell drones, we help you understand the system, get a hold of us. For the ones that think that these drones are just <laughs> you're, you're wrong, they're not. They're not just <laughs> They're really good. You just need to know how to run them properly. And I'm telling you, when you get it down and you understand it, they do an absolute really good job. I'm telling you guys, it is the future. Get a hold of us and we'll help you get started. I appreciate it. Thanks for the support. We'll see you guys on the next one.